do it. You scrawled on this video to do it. It's your boy, Daddy Scobar Dreamer. Alright y'all, we back with another big body banger, you feel me? Today we have something different, I'm not gonna lie to you, this this right here is something crazy, I don't think we've ever seen a video as crazy as this one, the title, I don't, I haven't seen the video actually, the title simply reads, dude gets stabbed, I can't, I don't wanna say it loud cause YouTube be tripping, but dude gets poked with something that's pointy by the father of his girlfriend because he confronted them after he found out or he found them sleeping in the same bed together. They were sleeping together. His girlfriend and her father were sleeping together. Not the girlfriend and her stepfather or her father-in-law. The girlfriend and the dude that made his 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 her mother pregnant. Her father, her biological daddy, you know what I'm saying? Found sleeping together. And he found them. So the father turned up and started poking him super hard with like these stick these pointy stuff. Some people call them knives. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm stuck. I'm baffled. There's cheating on your husband. There's cheating on your girl. There's, there's, che there's cheating. You know what I'm saying? And then there's cheating and incest with your dad. That's freaking disgusting. You know what I'm saying? So we finna, we finna watch this, man. I don't know what to expect with this. I don't know if we gonna see the footage. I don't know if we just gonna hear the story. But whatever it is. I'm ready to hop right into it. I know y'all are too. So just smash the like button for me. I would I would greatly appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. Hit the post notification bell so you could be notified whenever I drop these bangers. And every video I drop is a banger, so you're gonna be notified whenever I drop a video. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, that's really about it. Before we hop into the video though. <sighs> wow. My hair feels so nice. What is on my head? Durag.com, you can buy two and third free or can bundle up say $750. You know how the best Durax in the game. I don't really have to say much because y'all already know all of it. You know what I'm saying? It's the fiery. Now this this ain't the fiery camera. This is the yellow camera. You know what I'm saying? Go check this drawing out. This drawing heat. Super sexy. I'll be wearing it out and people be like, dang, yo, Durag fire. I'll be like, bro, it's not a Durag. Don't talk to me like that. It's a Durag. And then they'd be like, where can I get one? And then I tell them, cash at me a hundred million dollars and maybe I'll let them have one. You know what I'm saying? That's how it going usually. I make a couple million dollars off of that every day. But we finna hop right into this video. I'm not gonna pause it a single time. If I pause it, it I didn't pause it, just started buffering. Let's go. The group. A man finds his Who's wife you? naked. Who is you? Oh, I guess we ain't gonna see it. Vanessa Barnett. Oh, I thought it said Vanessa Bryant. That was that was Kobe's wife. You know what I'm saying? R.I.P. Kobe. R.I.P. Mom. You know what I'm saying? But, um, all right, let, let go. In bed with her own father. Wait, let's rewind this. I ain't hear that. A man finds his wife naked in bed with her own father and then is stabbed by his father-in-law. I'm Vanessa Barnett for The Griot with more details on this shocking story. After arriving at home in the wee... Man assaulted of sexually assaulting daughter and stabbing her husband. Wait, so they... Tr okay, so... I thought that she was cheating on him willingly. He assaulted her? Or is that what she's just telling them? I don't know. I'm, I'm not making no assumptions. I'm not making no assumptions. Hours of the morning, a 25-year-old man walked in on his wife and her father laying in bed nude. The 24-year-old young woman tells ABC7 News that she and her father were drinking and celebrating his recent release from prison. She doesn't remember anything after that. My husband comes in and he screams, what the F, who the F are you? And I looked over and I seen my dad get up and he puts his shirt on and then I look down and I don't have my underwear on. I don't have my jumper that I had on. I just had my t-shirt on. An altercation between the young husband and his father-in-law, identified by police as Henry Allen Michael, allegedly escalated outside. He pulled out a knife and stabbed him. After the incident, Michael allegedly fled the scene in his son-in-law's car. Authorities later found him in Detroit. He is currently being held at the Oakland County Jail. The husband was taken to the hospital and treated for a non-life-threatening stab wound, while the wife was examined for possible sexual assault. For the Grio, I'm Vanessa Barnett.
What? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, we gotta run this back, bro. Wait, though. No. So I thought the video was she got caught cheating, but apparently the father just got out of jail, right? And they were celebrating him getting out of jail. And then he drugged her. How did he get a hold of drugs when he just got out of jail? Anyways, he drugged her and she 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 woke up. She didn't remember nothing, but she woke up booty balls naked. And the father was booty balls naked. And the, 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 the husband came through and saw them both booty balls naked and started wilding out, waking them both up. I gotta wait. Hold on. I, I thought the video was much. I thought she was cheating. I thought it was incest. Like, well, it is because the, the father is stupid. You know, the father is. I got so much to say, but let's watch it. Come on, the group. Right? A man finds his wife naked in bed with her own father and then is stabbed by his father in law. I'm Vanessa Barnett for The Grill with more details on this shocking story. After arriving at home in the wee hours of the morning, a 25-year-old man walked in on his wife and her father laying in bed nude. The 24-year-old young woman tells ABC7 News that she and her father were drinking and celebrating his recent release from prison. She doesn't remember anything after that. So I don't know if he drugged her or they just drunk OD, but I've told y'all this multiple times in the videos, right? She had to have been drugged. Okay, these are the options. She got drugged. And the father drugged her because he's a freaking sick psychopath. Uh, he's a sick psychopath no matter what. No matter every instance here leads to him being a sick psychopath. Let me let me just clear that. Like he's wrong hundred percent. Nothing he's right about this man. You know what I'm saying? But there's there's a couple options. Either he drugged her, or she drunk too much and ended up sleeping with him. Cause maybe she thought, oh, he been in jail. I ain't seen him my whole life, so he not really my father. And then he ended up finessing her or whatever. That's some super weirdo stuff. You know what I'm saying? Maybe that's what her, her drunkness was saying. You know what I'm saying? So it's either that or it's that. Or that's not really her father. It's just some random old dude that she got caught laid up with. And she used that excuse so her husband wouldn't be mad at her. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, I, I don't know. I don't. That one's kind of far-fetched. It sounds more, it's either the first two, you know what I'm saying? That, other, that third option is kind of far-fetched, but that also still is an option. We got to keep that in mind, you know what I'm saying? But either way, the father is a sick psychopath. Sick? How you get, okay. You know, okay, these people getting out of jail, right? Let's, let's get in the mentality of a prisoner right now, you know what I'm saying? He been in jail, imagine he been in jail for 30 years or 20 years, whatever, you know what I'm saying? He in jail for 20 years, bada boom, bada bang. He gets out. You know, they, he ain't had no female interaction the whole time. He gets out. He see his daughter. He went he went and went to jail. She was three years old. Now he gets out of jail. She's 24. She's a grown woman. You know what I'm saying? She got titties now. She got a little booty. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. She's a grown woman now. He ain't seen her his whole life. So that's not really his daughter to him. He's just seeing a woman that's talking to him. You know what I'm saying? The woman is giving him time. But she's only giving him time because he's he just got out of jail. And that's her father. You know what I'm saying? But he's all he's seeing is coochie. You weird idiot. It's the weird psychopath is seeing cooter because he been in jail the whole time. All he's seeing is a bunch of booty holes and a bunch of slongs just slapping all around. You know what I'm saying? So he sees a girl and the girl is talking to him, giving him attention. So he thinks, oh, Shawty kind of feeling me. You know what I'm saying? He like, dang, Shawty kind of feeling me. Whole time it's his daughter. She just being a daughter and being nice. But he don't know that because he in freaking jail. Now he's a psychopath incest lover. <sighs> that my husband comes in and he screams with the f why this man got a doodle staying by his forehead bro like you on camera fix yourself man who the f are you and i looked over and i seen my dad get up and he puts his shirt on and then I look down and I don't have my underwear on. I don't have my jumper that I had on. I just had my t-shirt on. An altercation between the young husband and his father-in-law. He did all this just to go right back to jail, except for this time. I don't know what he went in for before. That would probably help with the story. If he went in for like sexual assault before or nothing like that, then he definitely he definitely did that. You know what I'm saying? He definitely like drugged or whatever like that. But if he was in jail for like, anyways, whatever he was in jail for, now he's going to jail for attempted murder and sexual assault. And probably a couple other other stuff. Stealing car. He just stole the car. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> he going right back in the pen. Identified by police as Henry Allen Michael, allegedly escalated outside. He pulled out a knife and stabbed him. 
after the incident, Michael allegedly. Where did he get a knife from, though? That's my. Where did he get the f the, the f and knife from? You know what I'm saying? He fled the scene in his son-in-law's car. Authorities later found him in Detroit. He is currently being held at the Oakland County Jail. <sighs> well, y'all, let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. This is crazy, bro. Like, homie, homie, literally. You know what I'm saying? Got out of jail and just targeted his own daughter. That's disgusting. That's that's sick. And it's sad that there's people out there that's really doing that foolishness. And she was just a victim to it all. If she was the victim, maybe she's lying. Like I said, there was the other option where she, she got super drunk and, you know what I'm saying, whatever. Or bada bada boom, it's a random old dude. It ain't really her father. It's just a random old dude. And she just covering it up. Saying that it's, it's, it's his father and she was sexually assaulted so that her, her husband want to be mad at her for getting clapped down by a random old goonie. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? It, I don't know the rest of the story. I don't know all the key factors, the puzzle pieces. But I'm just going from my own interpretation. Y'all let me know y'all interpretation in the comments down below. What do y'all think transpired? Y'all think she, she lying about this? Y'all think she truthing about it? You think it's really her father or some random goonie? Either way, that random goonie, that old head is a weirdo and a pedophile and incest and all that nastiness. You know what I'm saying? He's, he need to go back to jail, rot in prison. You know what I'm saying? I feel bad for the husband. No matter what the circumstance is, the husband did take an L in this. He got stabbed, you know what I'm saying? And his girl got whatever. Either he, she got assaulted or she got her walls knocked down by some random old man, you know what I'm saying? So it's an L for him either way. But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. That's really about it, though. Like the video if you haven't liked it already. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And hit the post notification bell so you can be notified whenever I drop these bangers. And I'm going to see y'all. Out. Hey yo, C3, so fly, hop out the butterfly. Wings to the sky, no, I'm never borderline. They choose I, cause I'm way above you. The waves make the haters love you when the ladies come through.